Hey guys, welcome back to another vlog. As y'all can see, we are in a whole new part of the house. Ugh, relax. <laughs> but um, I'm in my office right now. I Okay, I'm not going to move my head anymore. He should be used to this by now. He should be used to this camera. He should be used to the fame. He's acting like he's not used to anything. But I'm in my office right now and I decided to go ahead and decorate my office for this vlog because I asked y'all down in the comments if y'all want to see my bedroom or my office. Um, a lot of people said office first, so we're going to go ahead and do that because I feel like I'm going to spend the most time in my bedroom. So, yeah, I got a new desk in the mail, so I wanted to go ahead and put that together for y'all so we can start off with that and, like, do all the decorating a little bit later. So, let's just hop into our DIY. Y'all know I have a hard time putting stuff together, but this one is so easy and so simple. I can't wait till y'all see it. Let's go ahead and get into it. Thank you, Flexi Spot, for sponsoring this portion of the video. As you guys know, I work from home, so I've been on the search for months for an affordable, adjustable desk, and I finally found one with Flexi Spot. So, y'all, this desk came in two large boxes, and I was so intimidated because I just knew I was going to put this desk together piece by piece. But thankfully, it just came in two large pieces where I just had to snap on the legs, use the four screws that came with it. I did not have to use a drill, did not use a screwdriver. I just used the hard what they came with it thankfully and this only took me less than 30 minutes to put together i wish i would have set a timer if you've been watching my videos you know that i hate putting things together piece by piece so this desk came in handy i went with the white glass top because it went along with the aesthetic that i had in mind for my office and it's adjustable with four settings two usb ports and one phone charger for your iphone this desk also come with a spacious drawer where you can organize all your work necessities and i cannot wait to organize all my things y'all i love being organized so i went ahead and tested out with the height and y'all it worked perfect it was very smooth no noise at all and i cannot believe that so yeah this works out perfect i can't wait to get me like a treadmill or something so i can get me some steps in and yeah so i was able to charge my phone what desk do you know you could charge your phone this countertop is so spacious so i can have my computer my phone my ipad it is huge y'all thank you so much flexi spot for sponsoring this portion of the video everything to shout will be down in the description box thank you Hey you guys, so it is the next day and I decided to come downstairs and try to put up some wallpaper. This is probably one of the hardest things I've ever done. Granted, I put up wallpaper before in my other bedroom, but this is kind of hard. So this is what we're looking like so far. I honestly love it, I don't want to give up. And I was trying to look on Thumbtack to see if I could find somebody in my area that specialize in wallpaper, but nobody in my area y'all, so I'm having to do it myself. And so this, I wish y'all could see up under the wallpaper. Y'all see the actual wall? The paint is gone. Like, the paint is so cheap that they picked from my house. It's so crazy. So, it's going good right now. And I can see the indent, like, where my mirror goes. So, my mirror is going to still go here. Like, the mirror will be right here. So, it's smooth so far. So, yeah. I'm just going to let y'all watch me put up wallpaper. Good morning, y'all, and happy Sunday. So yesterday when I got done doing the wallpaper, I didn't do anything. I just sat on the couch and watched TV all day. 
So I wanted to show y'all an update. I ran out of wallpaper, so I had to order some more. And I got to finish like a little small section. And I was going to put this wallpaper upstairs in my office. But I got a whole new idea for the office now, y'all. Like, it's so pretty. And I feel like it's going to make the space more, you know, neutral. And I'm not going to say neutral. It's going to make it more colorful. That's what I should have said. Because I don't want my whole house to be like nude and white. Like, my bed is already like a nude color. I don't want everything just to be the same in every part of the house. So I wanted to switch it up. And I was looking at, let me sit y'all down. But do y'all see that? Like, it's so cute. I love it. And I got my inspo from Taja. And that is wallpaper, y'all. That wallpaper gave me a hard time starting out. But like, once it get down to like the middle part, it's smooth and going real good. So let me show y'all the inspo. I was gonna say I'm gonna put it on the screen, but most of the time I forget to put it on the screen. So look at this sage green color, like for the office. I think this is perfect. And my desk is white, so I can add like, you know, bamboo or something to like bring out the color some more. But yeah, I really want like an accent wall. And I wanna do an accent wall in my bedroom, but I don't know what color yet. I saw one girl did like a, Oh, I can't remember what color green it was, but like it was really pretty. But I don't want to do a green in both of them, so I'm gonna have to figure something out. And yeah, let me show you the wall. We still talking about it, but I haven't showed y'all. So this is what it looks like so far. And I ran out right there, y'all can just like a little corner piece, but I think it look good. It ties in the living room really good. And they go saying, "You want to tell them good morning." You don't want to talk today? Okay, yeah. Okay, he don't want to talk today. So, yeah. I feel like it ties in really good with everything. You know, just bring more color into the living room. And I got the greenery. But I was thinking about putting, like, a, a plant right here where Saint is. Saint need to move. Insert plant. <laughs> and we're going to hide the cord. So, I don't know if I'm going to do, like, a floating shelf. Or I really want a fireplace. Like, I think the fireplace will tie us all in together. So, yeah. Let me know what y'all think down below. Should we do the floating, like, TV stand? Or should we do a fireplace? I'm thinking about fireplace. I, I, don't, I never had one. And I always wanted one. So, I feel like it's going to go perfect. But, yeah. I was just sitting upstairs in my office. I had to come down here and get y'all. Because I left my camera down here last night. But... I was up there sitting in my office, and I'm really loving that dish, y'all. I love it. So, if y'all can, you know, shop down below. The link is in my description box for that dish. I love it. And um, right now, I'm about to get ready to go to Dollar General because I need, like, some cleaning supplies. I'm not going to go grocery shopping this week because I'm going out of town on next Monday. So, I feel like um, I'm going to do, like, the meal prep again. I did a meal prep meal prep <laughs> i did a meal prep from tzatziki's about two or three weeks ago me and my boyfriend did it so it lasts us from like monday through thursday we had the chicken uh rice potatoes and like the pita bread and we had salad too so we're gonna do that again and it's only like 44 dollars, y'all like to last you four days that's not bad at all because we didn't spend money on food at all. We already had food like for breakfast and stuff and we're starting to do like the intermediate fasting where we don't eat until 11 a.m so yeah we don't eat between 7 p.m and 11 a.m so that's like a whole lot of time that we don't even have to worry about having food or whatever but i got my oatmeal he says it an outage so let's go upstairs and make our um our grocery list not i keep saying grocery list y'all let's go upstairs and make our list for um dollar general so we can go get some cleaning supplies Okay, so I made it back upstairs in the office, and if y'all hear anything, it's the washing machine. I closed the door to the laundry room, but it's still kind of loud. But let's make the list. I know I need some, what is it, window cleaner, well, glass cleaner, because that mirror downstairs where I put the wallpaper, y'all dog be kissing the mirror or whatever. I don't know if he like looking at his stuff or whatever, but it's dirty because of him. So, let's get... Let's put Windex, but I don't think I want Windex. I want another brand. Um, I need plugins. I have not used plugins in this house. I've been here for four months, but I think I'm finally about to get some plugins because I forgot I got a dog. And I might have, like, you know how we walk to somebody's house, you smell things that they don't smell. And I hope my house don't smell like that, but I don't think it does because he don't stink. 
but we got plugins. I need some carpet. I call it carpet seasoning salt. Yeah, I know that, like, the little stuff you sprinkle down on your carpet before you vacuum. I'm gonna put carpet seasoning salt. <laughs> I'm so funny. Um, what else I need? Mm. Oh, we gotta get dog food. I need a job. Um, I need some more, like some spring. Oh, we might go in Dollar Tree too. Yeah, we may go in Dollar Tree because Dollar Tree have a lot of cute, um, spring stuff like for the kitchen. I might add a little color. Let's. I'm going to add Dollar Tree on here. Okay. So, yeah, this is about to be a fun morning. We are going to Dollar Tree and Dollar General this morning. So, yeah. Oh, and this is the wall, y'all, Um, that I want to do the green that I just showed y'all downstairs. I want to do the green here on this wall and some type of pattern. Like, the one I just showed y'all, I don't think I really want to do, like, that pattern because it looks too formal like this one i don't know i just love the color but i like this design so let me know down in the comments what y'all think what i would probably do is put it like a on my insta no on my on my youtube i can like communicate with y'all so i might put like five options on there y'all let me know which one y'all like the best because i know i want to go with the color i need to know what design i want to do but I don't know. I'm so happy because it's going to be a DIY project I can do by myself. And yeah, I think that's going to be so much fun. And I need to go ahead and do... Oh, this might be the next vlog. But like the pantry organization and the laundry room I've been talking about. I saw a lady on Instagram. She posted where she bought the shelves. The wood shelves that go along... Well, they go on top of her wire shelves. She bought them off Amazon. Like they have like different measurements or whatever instead of going to do it ourselves so i'm gonna look into that i couldn't find a link on her storefront but um i'm gonna try again because i think that's a good idea it's very time consuming it's not time consuming and like i could just paint them because they were white she got the white ones but i would like the bamboo because i want to do like black and bamboo in, in the pantry just like a little color scheme i want to do that instead of like doing a white and clear so yeah um let me show y'all my desk look crazy right now but I got all this stuff on here. I still haven't picked up the paper. But this is what the desk is looking like so far. It's, they go saying. That's what it's looking like. And this wall is huge to do like some type of decor. Um, I don't know like if a shelf should go there. Cause it has like a plug there and a plug here. So I could do a lot with it. And I still want like something. I don't know if I want to do like a vanity a sofa you know something else in here because i don't want it just to be an office i want it to be like um an office slash like girl cave girl room or whatever tv will go on that wall so i'm gonna have to figure it out i want to have fun in this room because i feel like if i'm not in my room i don't want to be downstairs and i could be in here like having my laptop up here editing and like doing work it's a game changer because for the longest I was downstairs on the sofa every day, like wearing out my sofa and having an office is just so, I love it. I love it. And I got my iPad. Since I don't have a TV, I got my iPad just going like y'all, I love it. But that's enough of me rambling and we got to clean the carpet going up the stairs when we get back because it rained the other day and I forgot to wipe y'all nephew feet. And he was going to get put out, but I thought about it. it was my fault because I didn't do it. And I bought that um that dry shampoo that I showed y'all in the last couple of vlogs. So yeah, I forgot to use it, but yeah, I make sure I um I gotta go ahead and clean it up because it's red mud and I hate it. So yeah, let's go ahead and go to these stores and I'll talk to y'all when we get there. <laughs> okay y'all so i done made it back home i went to well let's start over when i went to um when i went to dollar tree 
my camera did not record Dollar Tree or Dollar General. I'm so mad because when I was in Dollar Tree, like my camera kind of like fell back in the cart a little bit. So I guess it was thinking it fell on the ground. So it actually turned off and it didn't say none of that footage. But I'm gonna show y'all what I got. I did not know Dollar Tree had like all these cleaning supplies and like I've been wanting to try this stuff, but I didn't want to get the large container. But y'all, my mama used this. Um, she actually used a pine saw lemon. So I wanted to try like the light saw lemon. Can y'all see it? Oh, there it is. The light saw lemon. And I used it already on the floor. It smells so good. I got soap for soap for my um guest bathroom downstairs. Windex. And I already washed the window. Thank not the window, my mirror, because that dog. And I got furniture polish for my coffee table. Downy. This is something I really wanted to try. But to be honest, this is the cool cotton and it don't smell that good. Like, I mean, it's not bad. I, maybe it smells better on clothes. I don't know. Let's see. Some pink stuff dupe. <laughs> this is multi-purpose cleaning paste. I always wanted to try the pink stuff paste, but I was like, let's try this for a dollar to see if it really works. And I don't know who made garbage disposals, but I hate them and they stink sometimes. So I got these two garbage disposal. I really love this one because I love Army Hammer. Like all that stuff is really good. So I got these two things. I didn't know I got this one to be honest. But yeah. That cleans out your garbage disposal. Some toothpick. And y'all, this. I told y'all I wanted some carpet seasoning salt. But this. This smells so good. And it's only a dollar and twenty-five cents. It's a lot in here, y'all. It's heavy. This smells so good. Like I'm getting this for for now. This is the Island Breeze. So if you go in Dollar Tree, get the Island Breeze fabric softener. Well, not fabric softener. Carpet um soft. It smells so good. It smells like the beach. It just smells so good. And what else I got? Fresh linen. Oh, my camera finna go dead, y'all. But yeah, I'll talk to y'all later. I'm so sorry my camera go dead. I don't have no more batteries. This not charged. Sorry, see y'all later. Oh my god. y'all it's the next day and i just got back from the gym about it's been about an hour or two so i took a shower and i went ahead and logged in for work and i'm about to make me some breakfast now but i'm trying to do like a no sugar thing for like the next week since we're going out of um since we're going on vacation next week don't want to be looking fat in no swimsuit child but all i have for breakfast is oatmeal and it has sugar in it and it's so funny because out of all these flavors the only two I have left is the strawberry and the bananas and cream. Like, peaches and blueberries is my favorite. But it's like, I don't want to buy the box with just those in it. Because I kind of like the strawberry, but like, not a lot. So, I'm going to have a strawberry and cream. What do I want the banana? What if I do one of each? One strawberry and one banana. Y'all think that's going to be nasty? <laughs> but yeah, and I got two boxes. Two boxes full of strawberries and bananas i'm gonna put them all in one box so i can throw one away but yeah i meal prep with tzatziki's and i got the chicken kebabs with potatoes and is that it oh i got a caesar salad so yeah that's gonna last me for the next four days and i'm gonna make my oatmeal with milk it's time to get some more milk but all i have a plan for today is like when i get off work i'm gonna take saint to um tractor supply and he's going to get a bath because he stinks. He smells like outside. And yeah, it's been a minute. I try to bathe him every Sunday, but sometimes he don't need it because for the most part, Saint is outside for like 20 minutes a day. Just using the bathroom like three or four times a day. He's not outside a lot, so he don't really need it. But he needed it today. He's getting a bath today. 
and that's about it so i i don't know if this vlog was like boring or not i hope it wasn't but y'all know we used to doing stuff all the time but we didn't do much this time but i am going on vacation so y'all can get a travel vlog i'm excited about that because it had i haven't done one in like two months so yeah y'all let me feed that dog because he just staring at me like every time i come in the kitchen fixing me some food he looking at me like where am i at like you need to pick up your weight around this house son come here he won't even come he like he looked at me like girl bye he need he need a job I and i gotta show y'all some i guess i thought after i get done eating breakfast we can um go upstairs and measure my closet because I want to style my closet, but I don't want to do like the whole Ikea thing. I'm going to price some stuff to see because it might equal out like, the same price. I might as well just go with Ikea. But something like this. But instead of like the purses, I want something that I can hang. Like hang up my clothes and stuff. But I definitely need drawers. And I want like the nine that's like here at the bottom. And here's another one. Something like that. So do y'all see the dressers of like the dresser drawers over here? And then I don't necessarily have to have all that because I don't have a lot of stuff that I, that I hang up. But my I have two closets and they are huge. And y'all probably see like girls on Instagram do like the actual closet room. Like they use like a spare room to a whole closet. I was going to do that. But when you think about it, like I got two closets. Like that's what they're there for. So I'm going to build those out. Like remove the wire shelves that come with it. And, you know, just try to see what I can find. Because I want to use all my space. And I have... As of right now, I have a lot of clothes because the way that laundry room looking is giving I go shopping every day, but I don't. <laughs> but yeah, I'm going to have to figure it out and I'm going to go upstairs and measure. I need to, my measuring tape somewhere. I think it's over there. I'm going to take my measuring tape. We're going to see because I found the dresser drawer on Amazon. It's one on Amazon and um, Ikea. But Ikea has the six. And if I can do like two of the six, That'd be good. Or one of the nine. It just depends on how big my space is. Is that kid six? I think it is six. It's six. Yeah. I hope y'all enjoying the vlog so far. Let me know. Like, stop the video right now. Be like, <laughs> if this video is boring, just comment boring. <laughs> Loser. Loser. <laughs> y'all can comment that. I'm, I'm, I'll accept it because I know this vlog is like, eh, it's giving me it. I know. Let me know.